Hi everyone, we're the SIM education team here in the Royal Belfast Hospital for Sick Children. This is just a short video to show you how to administer buccal midazolam. This may be prescribed for your child if they have had a prolonged seizure or have an epilepsy illness. Every patient will have their own little box of buccal midazolam. This comes with four pre-filled syringes which are already drawn up doses of the medication. This means in an emergency you do not need to draw up any medication. Always ensure that the medication is in date and also that it is kept out of reach of all children as this medication can cause you to have shallow breathing. If the patient is seizing greater than five minutes or if this is, you have your individual epilepsy plan of what to do in a seizure, follow that. If you need to give buccal midazolam, remove the syringe from the container, remove the cap, make sure that the patient's mouth is dry and there is no secretions. You do not need to open the child's mouth to give this medication. You want to place the syringe in the corner of the mouth between the outside of the jaw and the gum. Give half of the medication in one side and half in the other. Give the cheeks a slight rub afterwards to ensure that the medication is absorbed. Stay with the patient at all times. If your plan is to ring an ambulance once you administer midazolam, ensure this is done. Never administer a second dose of this medication unless you have been advised to do so by your doctor or wait until the ambulance crew have arrived and they may want to administer another dose. If following the seizure and the administration of this medication the child becomes unresponsive or quiet, then make sure you begin to do your basic life support as demonstrated in the previous SIM education video.